Hello! <laughs> this is Pretty Sweet 50 and this is my first ever YouTube video, my first ever anything with Sims 3, my first ever time trying to capture video and it is hard. That is all I'm going to say about that. But let's just jump right into my legacy challenge. This is going to be the McNally legacy. It's going to start off with our matriarch. Allison Nally, if you guys don't know what a legacy challenge is, it's when you start with one sim on this ginormous lot and you have no money. And it's literally like that Drake song, started from the bottom, now we're here, and you have to literally get there. So we're going to go through, I already pre-made her off screen because I didn't feel like, I don't know, you guys wanted to watch that, but if you want me to show you how I make sims, <laughs> let me know. Um, anyway, so we're going to move on, we're going to move our outfits. Um, I am a big custom content junkie. I own too much custom content for my own good. <laughs> and so, if you have any questions, don't worry about custom content, um, let me know. So, I'm pretty, pretty psyched about what's coming up. In the Legacy Challenge, and I hope you guys all enjoy it, and we're gonna just spin around for these outfits with that. Let's jump right in the gameplay. Okay, and now we are here. This is our next scene. <laughs> this is where we live in our horse, guys. Look at this pretty background. Ooh, that is so pretty. So cute. Oh my gosh, waterfalls, rain, mist, towns, people. Alright, so first things first. We've only got $8,000 to our name, and that's not enough to build a house. So it looks like we're going to be, um, this is her little pump of gold. She's going to be living in for a little while. As for her career, I really want her to be um, in the daycare profession. But, since we don't have four walls yet, I don't think daycare is going to be our best option. On account of going to have kids over and they have to be able to sleep and be indoors and stuff. So, oh well, here we go. What is she doing? She is uh, browsing the web. Okay, we're going to go in. Ready. Look around town. Um, let's see. We find her job. Actually, let's kind of go join the education career path. Except she's a playground monitor. She does work at 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. and doesn't work on Saturday and Sunday. Pretty sweet, pretty sweet, pretty sweet. Actually, I am an education major at my school, so I want to be a teacher, but I don't want to be a playground monitor. <laughs> but you gotta start somewhere, I guess. And she just met a ghost, and there's a mysterious thing, and I was kind of not looking to have the time portal on um, my lot, so I'm gonna get rid of it. Because I didn't want it. And I'm gonna sell the sell it for money. I'm gonna sell this for money too. Look, yes. All right, so let's go. Check on her. She's got a job. She wants to get married. We can promise that. She's not gonna be an investigator. She's not gonna get the fortune told. I don't know what she's doing. She's reading babies and coming. Um, somebody's got big on the brain. Let's see if they have anything like reading that will help us not reading totally pressures, no, it's bad, it'll fix anything. Um, but anyway, back to where we were. 
want to ever go to the library actually now. I don't know where that is. I don't play all those guys often. I probably should go around and figure out where everything was first. That is not a library. That is in the park. That is the lead in the room. I don't know when I'm sitting at home to go paint some pictures. I want to have come here <coughs> and um, online dating. Real profile. I would find a man. Gotta have a man if you want to get rich and stuff one day. Have a man. Somebody can do the money, maybe not. Not anybody rich. Because that's not part of the legacy challenge. Saber profile just the way it is. And Mark's going to go ahead and let's, um, mm, online dating, uh, brass profile. Brass profile. Here we go. Ooh, Victor Stern isn't that bad looking. Pedro is cute. He's a coward. He's definitely lucky. Boris. Miller. The message. Pedro is cute. Let's uh, more. No. Let's just. Uh, she wants to check online dating. Oh, you got Pedro? No, he's a pop That's a pop Nazi. She's not a celebrity. I don't know what's going on, but um. Mm, online dating. Check messages. What you want to do? Check messages. Yeah, so I'm check our messages. No messages. Okay. Okay. We're gonna get on home. Woohoo, got some. Need somebody online. That's not a stalker or maybe he wants to kill her. That's great. Um, we're gonna have her so we can go back and see. Because we can do that because we have a huge story. I have this little outdoor living section over here. She can see. Cook us up some food and still got some money left. Still can't afford walls. And apparently, she's starving. I had to serve some up so she can uh, eat it later. So I'm eating that a lot. I feel like let's have her use all in the bathroom and then go to sleep. Not for so long. Be with it, and I will be back with you guys in the morning. Hey, everybody! This um, it's morning, and Allison is up and we're ready to go and she's about to head off to work after she cleans up the dishes and it is raining and she is soaked but that's what happens when you're poor and you have no money whatsoever and she is at work and we will pick this part up when she gets out of work hey everybody allison is just getting off of work well, she's staying late. Did you see that horse run by? That was freaky. All right. Um, she got an opportunity while you guys were gone to stay late and help with grades to increase relationships with coworkers. So I had her do it, you know, make friends at the office, you know, and I was going to come handy. So right now we're going to go ahead and we're going to head to the the um, library for a while. So when I got her a bike and an umbrella while you guys were gone too because it's raining and she is soaking wet and when you're soaking wet you want an umbrella you don't have to stay soaking wet because you know she doesn't have a roof at her house and that just sucks I couldn't imagine if I didn't have a roof I couldn't imagine living outdoors I'm not one for like camping and stuff not that you need to be the people who like camping I just know I couldn't do it <laughs> but anyway so we're gonna have her go up here and we're gonna have her person at her home yeah I thought she could do that um, we're gonna have her check her messages, and we're gonna have her more, 
Wilds with Cool Falls. And then, let me see if they have a weed. Kind of books in there. Oh! Pedro, we don't fit. What I, you don't know what I'm looking for. But Victor said, can you check out my profile? I think we can be a pretty match. And Jesse said, hey Allison, I saw that we have some common interests. Friends, we're going to accept his request. That is so cute. Okay, Pedro, apparently I'm like, this is Victor. Let's look at him and then we'll back. And look at Jesse, I think I saw him. He's artistic. They lie on these things. I'm not even going to lie. I know they do. Um, easily impressed. Frugal. A daredevil. A frugal daredevil. He must do like low budget stunts. That was a joke. I know you're probably not laughing. But I think it's pretty hilarious. Um, and here's Jesse. He's cute. He's athletic. Uh, bookworm. Brave. Unflirty. And a vegetarian. Mm interesting. Poopy Carbonara is his favorite food. Classic music slim. Hmm. Both of them are pretty cute. Um, let's see. These two could be like twins. Let me take up guys okay. Adam. I would totally have her get with him but he's rich. So let's see Victor. Mm -hmm. Alright, so she wants to meet someone online. Let's see, did accepting zero co workers chain? She works with a lot of people. Oh, look, here's Victor. Let's, um, let's text him. Friendly text messages. And then let's, let's uh, chat. Let's go call them. Let's see if this is. We're gonna rain to stop, which will probably never happen. Oh, she's so adorable. She's on a phone with me. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> so, I know there's um, first couple parts that are going to be exciting. There's going to be really good things going on. I'm probably going to end this one real soon. And let's do another one. But, yeah, we're pretty much going to miss a lot. As far as Sims go, I'm like YouTube watching Sims. Um, I was really inspired to actually do this. Like, I really, wa I really always wanted to do this. Make a let's play and legacy like, challenges and all that. And my roommate Candace really, oops, yeah, Candace really wanted me to mm, try it. But I really swear by Betsy Sim Avenger. I don't know if you guys follow her on YouTube, but if you don't, you should. She was hilarious. She's funny. I think it was great. So totally jealous. So many just like her. <laughs> Not in a weird, creepy kind of way, though. But yeah. So we're still going. I'm browsing some more profiles. Pedro. Look at ghosts. Who wants to date a ghost? That's scary. That scares me. Mm. Let's send Victor another message. Even though I'm pretty sure he's sent his message back. Let's go. More. Let's check messages. I think it stopped raining. So I think those delete. It's done. Let's um we're gonna hit on home. And her bikes, the speed being in her bike. She is hungry. Let's get some food. We don't have to use all the bath and I don't know what. It's just easier to do that. We never go to sleep. And once again, we will. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> that was so stupid. <laughs> but as you can see, Allison's awake and it is time to get ready for work and have her use all. In one bathroom. I don't know why I have these bathrooms so much. I just love it. I love the all in one bathroom. It is so cool because it like fixes all your problems at once in that little bath. It looks like a porta potty. Like a porta potty with a sliding door. That's what it makes me think of. Um, 
you ever have a quick meal of yogurt? You want to go for it? Get some yogurt? I actually don't want to ride. Can we go for it? I want to ride on the bike. So let's go for work. I'm going to go for the bike. I don't know if I'm going to go for the bike. There we go. I'm going to pay that. You know what the repo man is coming? The repo is over. We're living on a lot. There's no walls. So I'm going to pop the race skill, but I'm looking at you. You're not doing that. So Okay, it is at work, Allison is home. I'm gonna pay your dog, I guess, for six, seven dollars. That is a lot of money for some bills. Not really, but she's really stressed, apparently. And her house is really messy, um. She doesn't have a house to be messy with. But she doesn't want the outdoors. She doesn't have a paint or that thing. Hopefully, that'll give her some. Like, these terrific bars and stuff. And of course she's sleeping at 4 o'clock because what happens when you're a teacher you get tired a lot. It's not even a teacher that she's still a great night. Hopefully she can fix that. Okay. Well, this one's really interesting actually. And once again, it's a good morning in the life of the house in the alley. <sighs> We're going to wake up, eat some breakfast, get ready for work, and then days are pretty much coming redundant, unfortunately, because <laughs> it's just her, and she really needs to get money, so going to work it is, and it is um, 77 degrees in the summer, it's not bad, it's not too hot, she wants to cool down, I'll give her that, she wants to dark one, it's not too hot, cool down, I'll take my money for walls, it still tastes, tastes like a fridge, because the refrigerator is like the cheap one. So <laughs> the food, it says every um, bite shouldn't contain flavors from everything else in the fridge. Quality fridges never have this problem from cheap fridges. And she's well rested from her bed. That's good. She's fascinated from contemplating interesting objects. And then she's suntanned because, you know, they don't have a roof, so all she does is in the sun all day. And she is golden bronze, apparently, and getting warm as an indicator for that. You should also have a cooking skill. Totally going to do that one because she is a natural cook. I gave her, like, mom traits. I don't know if I said that in the, um, when I was showing you guys her traits and stuff earlier, but... She's a genius, which is going to be our family trait because in the challenge, because the challenge, you're allowed to have a family trait and that all your family sins will have, and you have to randomize everything else. So, genius is going to be our family trait. And she's a nice cook, she's neat, she's family oriented, that's what she wants to get married. I think we're going to have her marry. Um, Victor? He seems really sweet. Um, let's see. How to run recess. To improve your job performance and increase your relationship with your boss. So we're going to have a read the books for three of many job fast relationship things you can turn on again. So after work, I'm going to have her invite Victor out. In about, that would give us something to do. So we have nothing to do. First couple of parts. I'm not gonna. I don't know if I want to get away sooner or later. I don't know what kind of job Victor has. And 
things that Bridger does is just stressed out from work, from Grand Boss's papers. So let's just have to take it easy for the rest of the day. Trying to get that strain over there. It's just a fulfillment. It's just a worst. Mm -hmm. She's getting promotion today. I'm feeling that. I'm feeling the promotion coming. Today is the day. I'm not going to put this on the road. Sit here and wait. You need to stop it. I'm going to put this out. So I don't know why I'm talking to myself. But anyway. Hey. And she has just done the whole lesson. She's done the whole work. And oh, we got a promotion. We are now a teacher's aide. Which is really our uh, beginning level. Um, when you are becoming a teacher, if you take the alternate route, instead of going to college and getting a degree, you can become a teacher's aide and then go to school while you're a teacher's aide, which we offer at my school for adults. Well, it's kind of cool, but it says, congratulations, Allison's impressive performance has earned her a promotion to teacher's aide, as well as a bonus of $276 when the other teacher needed extra help grading papers and erasing chalkboards they'll turn to you you are well liked by the school staff because of your calm demeanor punctuality and reliable nature just remember to keep those hall passes locked away or you'll be the one staying after school for detention so she is going to be inviting her out. Um, we're going to go somewhere chill, casual. Let's have them go to the somewhere where she is. The community pool. Let's have her go to Bassett Beach. Is that what it's called? Basalt. Basalt Beach. Let's go to the beach. Let's go to the beach. B plus put away. Wait, 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 what are they gonna say? Hopefully he says yes. No, I'm not interested in Out. She wants to clean the bathroom, so let's do that. Let's clean the bathroom. Then let's Nice. But I really want to let's invite Victor out again to the beach and see what he says. Victor, go to the beach with us. Oh, I can't imagine wanting to go anywhere with you right now. Dang. So let's just call him and chat with him and see what he does. Man. Let's talk to him. Let's talk to him. Let's invite him out to the beach and see what he says. Actually, forget meeting people online when you can meet them in person at work. Oh, let's invite him to the beach. Let's see what he says. He's a co worker. He said, No, I'm not interested right now either. No one is interested in her. No one finds her attractive but that ghost guy, and that is not cool. At <laughs> all. Oh. Okay, well, it's worth a shot. We'll have her computer pay. Look, her avatar is tan because she's got the sun chain thing for 12 hours. Be in the sun all the time. She just grabs some basic pain skills, which is good because we can use some pain skills. Oh, we got invited to a party. We we're totally gonna want her co workers to always have a party. And we're gonna go head over there. And hopefully we'll get free. <laughs> free. Sorry, the little bike's so adorable on the bike. Is this your co house? This is really nice. Really, really, really nice actually. This is really big. Can we get some food? Just have a quick meal. Yogurt. Just eat their yogurt. She's hungry, she's gonna eat their yogurt. Please don't be mad at me for eating your yogurt. 
we just hit the workers. Behaving inappropriately, we're so sorry. Um, let's be friendly and let's, let's uh, friendly. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see who else is hanging around town here. Are you cute boys? Let's take a little break. Alright, day. Is that a cat? That is a cat. Honey cat. Oh, that's so cute. Go here. Let's see. Any cute people? No attracted to Oh, they're flirting. Okay. That's Adam Birch. He's rich. Oh, look at the cat. The little kittens are so cute. Friendly induction. You cover it and give to Adam. They can be friends, even though she's not allowed to have her be friends with him. Give him a high five. And then, uh, get to know him. So I'm pretty sure with Lindsay Jones, because you can't marry rich people. I don't know why you can't marry rich people. We're making them part of our poor faith. But it just doesn't matter. Um, yeah. I like you, that cat. I love her. I wonder if her co coworkers who invited her to the party would let her adopt a pet. Let's see. I don't think she'll let her go. Are you going to be kidding for adoption? Because I want Jeff to catch. Where's she going? Hey, I was talking to you. What the heck? Why is that up there? I would like to adopt a pet friend. Please stop me. Let so me ask you about it. Oh, she's going to let me adopt one. Jasper, he's a kid. He's a mixed green. He's not stuck in playful. We want Jasper. Yes, we want Jasper. We just adopted a cat. So this is our cat. So we have just adopted Jasper cat. And, um, he's so cute. So cuddly. Praise him for no, no. Gold him for being okay. We're taking him home with us. We can't kill a baby home with us. See the person who they robbed the house? We're here at the house. Now we have Jasper. I don't know how that works in legacy challenges, but we've got a cat. In our legacy challenge now. We <laughs> Jasper the cat. <laughs> and we need to go and uh, get Jasper some cat stuff. We just need to get him a bowl. We can sleep on the bed. Can't cat, let's get the cat a house. Jasper's a cat. He's not a dog. Jasper's the cat. Let's get Jasper uh, one of those kitty scratch close jungles. Wait a minute. That's a lot of money. I'm still gonna do it. Okay. Get him a bowl of food, old food bowl. He can sleep in a bed with her for all I care. He can probably sleep in here. Can you sleep in there? I bet he can. Yep, he can sleep in there. He's so cute. Look at his little face. You wanna see it? Look at that little face. He's so cute. He looks kind of like a Cheshire cat, though. That weird smile he's got. He can sleep in there. She was going to sleep. She had a good time. She is really good friends with Balder Essien. They are acquaintances. He is. And it's leisure day. Woo. Woo. So pretty excited about that. 
with Blue the Dr. Cat. It's Loser Day. And I'm going to end this part right here. And I will see you guys in the morning of next time of another part when it's Leisure Day. Ah, beat awesome.